Hey, I'm going to explain different types of fractions. Yeah, there actually are different types. Before I get into that really quick, because I don't want to take up too much time, I just want to remind everybody that the top of the fraction is called the numerator and the bottom is called the denominator. Okay? So, the first type of fraction is a proper fraction. What we know about it is they're always less than 1, and the top is always smaller than the bottom. The numerator is always smaller than the denominator. All of these numbers here are less than 1. If you have half of something, that's not 1. It's smaller than 1. Okay? An improper fraction, these are equal to 1 whole or larger than 1. And the top is always bigger than the bottom. The numerator is always bigger than the denominator. So, these are improper fractions. See how the tops are bigger than the bottoms? These are all improper because the numerators are too big. Sometimes people call these umbrella fractions because the top is so big and the bottom is small. Then the last type of fraction is called a mixed number. It's a whole number written next to a fraction, but it's all together as one number. Like these. These are mixed numbers. So you got one and two fifths, three and four fifths, one and one third, eight and two ninths, twenty-five and three sixteenths, or twelve and five eighths. Those are mixed numbers. So, really quick, one more time. The numerator is on the top, denominator is on the bottom. We've got proper fractions that look like this, where the numerator is smaller than the denominator. We've got improper fractions that are equal to 1 or bigger than 1, where the tops are bigger than the bottoms. And then we have mixed numbers that look like this, that have a whole number next to a fraction. Those are the three types of fractions. I hope that helped.